<laughs> All right, hello everybody, welcome to World Cup Hype Game 1, Chaos against Skaven. Um, and uh, Skaven are a pretty decent team to play first, I think. I mean, yeah, he might get lucky with the gutters, but if he doesn't, he's got armor 7 for Kaz, SPP. And uh, they're a bit, they're, they're at the worst at 1000 TV, I think, Skaven, so <laughs> this isn't so bad. He's got four gutters, you can always potato on screen. And your three dice block blitzes that you'll be trying to do. Uh, not not always pals. Oh yes, let me welcome Fashbinder who here is amazingly with me on uh, on Discord. Thank you very much, Fashbinder. Oh hello. <laughs> hello. <laughs> yeah, no roger is good. I've been here. Jealous. No roger. No roger. None of this uh has a return on the Blitz shenanigans. Yeah. Yeah, the Rogue is pretty devastating, isn't it? Should I kick? Always Should receive I... your Madman. What? Receive your Madman. Why receive? Make safe two die blocks, grind him out for eight turns, and then score. You think that's better than kicking? Receive him. Okay, I'll do what Fash says. He's, he's the boss. <laughs> <laughs> Don't cry on your roof. <laughs> Get set out in a movie there. <laughs> Stop watching now. This guy is nuts. Oh dear. Is this guy? Is this a nuts guy? Hi. Have fun. He's got a thrower as well. Absolute man. <laughs> yeah, no one below thirty was around in the catch fast streaming. Yeah. Fash is. <laughs> Fash is a is a relic, isn't he? Is coaching against the rules? It doesn't say so, barbecue sack. Um, but I would, I would argue that not being coaching, it was yeah, just, it was just. I'm just making of, commentary. Yeah, it was just a bit of banter, friendly banter between friends. Like what, what's better than actually. kicking? Receiving, of course. Yeah. It's a definitive, a statement of fact. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, there's no way this team's qualifying. Jim's gonna do something dumb, get tired, go on tilt. And then uh, it'll be World Cup Hype 3 is the team. That's yeah, uh, what I'm putting my flash points on. Oh. <laughs> 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. English football chances, rap music. That would be amazing. But um, it might it might get the videos muted and, and cause legal issues. I don't really want... <laughs> Do I want my warriors in the fight? I don't think so, do I? I think I want them protecting. Protecting against bullshittery. Defensive setup, Jim. Well, look, look at this Skaven defense. I don't know what this is. I did not invent it, but it is not a legitimate defense. So not only uh, <laughs> is he not protecting anyone, uh, but it's like a rule of five, but not. This is the worst <laughs> possible setup. From this, I would infer that my opponent's new to Blood Bowl, and I wouldn't be too concerned uh, with the, the sideline push on a blitz, even though having a warrior there is still a really good idea. Yeah. Thanks, Fash. Good analysis. Good. But yeah, no, there's a, there's a two dice on one of those gutters for sure. Ah, <laughs> uh, BZL's on, on vacation. All right, so that's good. So this guy can't pick up the ball. That's, that's nice, isn't it? <laughs> right, and uh, yeah, I think I can accept failed blocks here. I don't want to, but I think I can. If only some safe plays were made first. <laughs> These are safe plays, Fash. I don't know what you're talking about. First. Not after the block, what was that? If that was a one in eighty-one. Do you know how sad you'd be? It would have been a one in nine. I, I would have, I would have. I thought. Now, well, I'll tell tell you why then, Fash. Because I was happier where they were if I one in nine that I wouldn't have re-rolled it. So now, no. now that this is now that now that I'm now I'm making the moves so that if this one's a one in nine. Um. So yeah, there you go. That, it, I wasn't. I was doing safe moves first. Believe it or not. No, I don't know. Danke. I know he's a 3 plus 2 plus for a ball pickup through uh, the left side gap. 
Although, you know, the left side diagonal. Spooky times. Spooky times. Alright. Do I do the blitz first? Oh, yeah. Uh, you could do. You could do. Yeah, dodge there, and then dodge there, and then... Uh, there's lots of guys, though, isn't there? Yeah. I'm okay with this. I think I can, I can go for the blitz now. Bit of a failure. Bit of a failure to launch on that blitz. And do I re-roll the pickup? It is against Skaven. Ooh, that's, a, that's a tough one. Your screen's good. Yeah. Now that you didn't fail any blocks. <laughs> yeah. And this is the thing, isn't it? I've got to think for a minute and a half, thanks to this stupid 15 second rule. I've got to think for a yeah, minute and a half, instead of just trying to pick it up. And I want to pick it up. There's no doubt that my move is, is move diagonally back here and pick it up. But then, it's, if I fail, I've got to think about whether we roll, and I can't... I should have this 1 minute 20 to think about it. So all these people, I'm going to clip this, right, and show all these people who argue with me on the forums, who are fucking idiots, who say, I always know if I'm going to re-roll before I roll and before I make an action. You've got to so think it's about... One in, it's 1 in 64 for the worst possible scout ever. Hits a beastman on the left, and then hits the other beastman on the left, and then lands on the corpse. And yeah, it could lands, go that way, that way, that way, that way. Yeah, that would be a bad scout, yeah. wouldn't it? That would be real bad. One in sixty-four um, there. Hmm. <laughs> yeah. It, unless it's the worst possible scatter, I think you get away with not re-rolling it. You can blitz but even this then, guy. Like, the blitz comes along and gets someone out of the way. Yeah, because I haven't got a double stack. I didn't really want to move this guy to here because, but you know, I did because I thought it was a bit safer. But actually, I'll, I'll, then there's a no double stack here. So if I go here and fail the pickup, he blitzes him, and then a good runner comes up and picks it up quite easily. So I think yeah. I am going to re-roll it. Oh, chaos. Wasted a minute there because should have oh, been nice. able to decide afterwards. You've only got three rolls and no block. You're gonna be making blocks. Yeah, but it's it's bullshit, isn't it? It's bullshit because you should only have to. Very think, bullshit. You should only have to think for a minute, one in three times. But you've got to. You've you need to, to think for a minute. Yeah. I'm gonna think for a minute for fun. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> See, this is this is the thing because this wasn't a double screen here because I've moved this guy to an irrelevant position, which I shouldn't have done. So yes, so yes, as as Orlando says, if you re-roll, you made the screen wrong, and I did because I this I, this backside did not need to be covered. Well, it kind of, uh, it kind of did before I made the block though. That's the problem because if I hadn't made this blitz, if I double scored the blitz, then it was just a three plus two plus to go and get the ball. So. Mm -hmm. Base, base, base. This one fail. Time armor. <laughs> do, do, do. Do, do, do. Yeah, of course. Of course, we've got the ball base. <laughs> you give us Burn a ball. octave higher. Da, 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 da. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wah, 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 wah. Oh, wah, wah, wah. This won't fail. I'm armoring. Face the ball. Oh, bash by. Yeah, exactly. I, I make four blocks and get nothing. He makes one and gets a stun. I mean, it's only a stun. It's not the end of the world. But it's ma mildly annoying. If you're being positive, then uh, you've got to fucking suck it up. Stop bitching like a little baby and try and fucking play better, eh? Mildly annoying. Fash now do the Sage impression, Johnny Five says. <laughs> Oh, oh, I'm a saint! I'm a new Zionist! <laughs> oh, gee, can you do a zunk? Uh, not really. He's just generic British, isn't he? I don't know what he is. He's like a weird part of Britain, though, not like the one accent that I can do. I do like the Lupac British. You know, just a little bit. I think in that over here you make a little two dice block, and it's pretty nice. I've seen some. I, I, I sim some things. I've seen some things. Okay. Yeah. Um. So Skaven Coach with the uh, Tyrion defense in which he half manses. Gives away an immediate free block for no reason on his uh, number nine line right on the left. He does indeed. Uh, Jim making a first action two dice without any consideration for anything failing. Uh, clears away the man marking the ball. I don't think I could make any consideration for things failing. Purely because that that one had to work there. I had to, to re-roll it. 
always consider mm. things fairly. Yeah. Had to work. It was a block that on a push, you had a follow-up, so that was good there. Yes, and another follow-up after that as well. Um, so now the question is whether this guy goes here or here. Um, I think here's good. Mm, maybe it isn't. Maybe here's better. Let's go here. And another 2D. Okay, oh, so we've outblocked him 5 to 1. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, six to one, and he's made a he's made a stun. Done nothing. Um, right, looks like Senai's going to go, so I shall be right back. Goodbye, Senai. Juice. <laughs> yep, that's Senai gone right. So uh, she's coming back with she's coming back with kebab as well. So that's pretty. What good. if she never comes back? She's like, oh, I'm gonna get some milk, and she never comes back. <laughs> she's gonna come back into her flat. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he opened his turn with a one dice. First that's good. action one D. That's what you get. <laughs> He's made both stuns so far. He's made two blocks and got us done both time. Lucky for me. <laughs> It, was... it wasn't even for anything good. Like, it was a 1D to do nothing. Yeah. That was a absolutely bizarre. I'm not dice ranting. I'm not dice ranting. I'm not dice ranting. I'm dice observing. I'm really not bothered by the dice. Um, I was just pointing it out because I just thought it was funny. Um, it's a definitively poor decision. That's what you get for starting with a 1 die. Yeah, exactly. Um, now we can blitz a good run 3 dice into, into another 3 dice. Um, it's something I want to do, even though it even though it sticks me out on a limb a bit. Oh, I can't make it. I can't do it in another three days. Fuck. Oh well, that's okay anyway. Is he in stream? Maybe. Okay. <sighs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> that was an epic, an epic hit. <laughs> I really don't have to re-roll these, do I? I think putting him to there means that I don't have to re-roll if this is a failure. And I'd rather fail this one than the other. Oh, it didn't fail. Feels good, man. Doesn't it just... Not getting to move forward though on turn three is a bit shit. Uh, after that one dice, maybe I should have uh, done something to uh, move forward more. Because I could move my square forward. <laughs> no, when they basically, you have to block them away, uh, yeah, or you know, do some stupid dodging out, uh, which you never do at this point. Uh, he just hasn't paid the price for the needless spacing. Yeah. They could, he could have just been one square back, had the same sort of uh, effect, and and not risk being men down. Yeah. True. That's what you get. He might not be in stream, might have just seen it before, might he? Well, then he wouldn't know Fash was here. That's what you get. <laughs> That's Fash's most famous, uh, most famous quote, isn't it? <laughs> What do you mean? Stay Fantastic's my most famous quote. <laughs> yeah, so yeah, and the Fash Diamond, of course, your, your amazing yeah. uh, defensive formation. And the Fash Square. <laughs> the Fash Anchor as well. <laughs> yeah. The Fash, <laughs> the Fash Space Invader. Yeah. <laughs> Just stop the one turns. <laughs> no, I mean, I'm not really, I'm not really whining about the lack of AB breaks or successful blocks. Now you're whining about not whining. <laughs> no, I'm not. It was just because you obviously are things are still going quite well. Um, if he made a Kaz or a KO, then maybe I'd be complaining. Um, but no, yeah. no, you, you weren't whining before, but you, you, you are now, for sure. No, no. <laughs> yeah, you are. No, I'm not. Press, press one if Jim's whining about not whining. Fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck off, I'm not. Um, <laughs> hey... Look at all these ones popping up. 
Chaos Art, yeah, exactly, Wolfpack, yeah. It's given our nice, you do have a shot at some stuff there. <laughs> I didn't learn. Dirty mutt. <laughs> Dirty mutt. Oh, dear, Flash. I mean, I do need to get forward, and a stun's pretty decent for that, but I would like more, wouldn't I, to be able to get, to get forward more. It's a shame that Cave Event gave him an extra reroll. He'd be done, though. Down to one on turn three. Yeah. Shame about the uh, shame about the snow there. Or I could have maybe surfed this guy. Um, could have pushed into there, brought an assist round, and then this beast man could have gone one, two, three, four, five, six GFI and surfed him. But in the snow, I can't even attempt a GFI, can I? Um, nope. And now we've got a 2D here, 2D here, 2D here, 2D here. I think I have to blitz this guy. But um, I could block him, actually. This block is the only one that has to work in that case. This guy down there, I don't think I'll put the ball anywhere else. I think I just have to make this block. It was a success. <laughs> kind of. <laughs> um... <laughs> Everything else can fail now. But it is turn four. And with a block here and a block here and a blitz here and a block here, I could actually move the cage up, so I think I will reroll blocks now. Boo. A little bit frustrating. <laughs> a lot frustrating. Lame. Okay, now now actually it's a struggle, isn't it? Because everything's failed. Well, not failed, but hasn't worked. <laughs> Blocks for pushes. Feels bad, man. Got to show that up with a warrior. Um, I really want the assist to make that extra block, don't I? So. Yeah, boy. Ooh, powder gutter. Powered unbelievable, Jeff! <laughs> Gets the assist as well. Let's him follow up and mark him. Yep. Oh, mate, seven blocks that turn. You got uh, one knockdown. Good work. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty, pretty violent, violent stuff from these, uh, <laughs> these kids. These Dark Delights have violent ends. Yeah. I am due for a 1 in 9, yeah. I've made way, way more than 9 blocks. I've, I've been lucky not to fail a block so far. Um, of course I would have liked knockdowns <laughs> there. I really could have really could have progressed, you know, with, with, with any knockdowns here. The cage could have been up here. Um, but without knockdowns, staying put is more sensible. What, what is this, Jim? What is he doing? I don't know. He's just standing people up. I don't know. He's been blessed by uh, Nuffle, and she's just gotten away with everything he's done, except for those one days. <laughs> except for and those things he just... hasn't got away with. <laughs> yeah. Well, no, I mean, that, that's it. When you, when you make one D blocks, you deserve to die. Um, <laughs> In real just life, instantly... you the player? <laughs> Both. <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, unfortunately, yeah, him just giving me loads, a bunch of blocks is actually a good strat for him because, you know, I, I haven't got block and I'm going to fail him. Yeah, so much for the grind him down eight turns, yeah. Yeah, I really would like to make any removals eventually. <laughs> would be good. I, I think you should I think you should rescind the statement that it's an effective strat. Instead, you should say it's a uh, risky gambit. A risky gambit. <laughs> yeah. It is a risky gambit, yeah. Okay, that's that's a better that's a better way of wording it. To be fair. Finally, the old man's after four turns of no punishment. Yeah, exactly. That's the thing. He, he has not been punished for his his relentless basing, and I really needed him to be punished for some of it at some point to get ahead. And now, I've got two guys on the floor. He's got everyone stood up. <laughs> the ball's based. It's a. Uh, it really is a problem at the moment, isn't it? It's a real. Assume the last guy that marks your rear beastman, and uh, you've got 
ample opportunity to clear it if the block on the Storm Vermin is a uh, oh. better than a push. <laughs> Dirty Dingo. Oh man, he's made what like four blocks and got a KO. And I had to follow there to keep him on the sideline. I didn't want to follow. If you, if you noticed, I, I, I took a while to decide to follow. Because <sighs> I thought he could bring around the gutter in two dice. And I didn't want to give away two dice there. And I probably just shouldn't have followed. So I, 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 get, I, get, I get punished for my one basing with a KO. Meanwhile, he's all men's herp derp all the time. Rough. Rough indeed, right? He's just gonna clear him first. No, no, no he's just gonna <laughs> first. Right, this because this one just has to work more than any other, doesn't it? It did work, <laughs> kind of. Right. <laughs> oh dear God. Right, they all have to work at this point. Oh my God, really. Did you uh, push that basement forward just for the extra block, or did you consider getting a uh, semblance of a cage in that area? Just, just for the block. <laughs> oh. I, I don't know where I can cage because of that down guy. <laughs> I'm going to have to cage up here. So now I'm going to rely on a one dice. So it kind of worked. <laughs> I'm so fucked. Yikes. Oh boy. The good thing about good only enough. rolling pushes is <laughs> not turn But yeah, ball cage is based. He can uh he can get one dice on the ball here easily. But never mind. I mean that's not surprising, is it, when you when you've been outbashed <laughs> by Skaven who've based you incessantly. <laughs> yeah, I think you'll muff it up there. Just quietly. Yeah, I have hopefully. a hunch. Yeah, hopefully I shouldn't say a thing, should I? Because it might give away yeah. opportunities. So um, I don't wanna I don't wanna call out moves that my opponents can make. I always do that and it's something that I should curtail in case they are in chat and haven't seen something themselves. He should spend all his men getting that gutter runner a free block. Yeah, on that's, number five something, that's yep. something that, that Lupac did perfectly. Would always would all you would always call out terrible, terrible plays for his opponents to make. And uh I need to start doing that more. <laughs> A goblin team would trash me blob skills McGlob. <laughs> As we've seen, this 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 Skaven team is worse than a goblin team because he's basing me with defenseless players with armor seven and I'm still not doing anything. <laughs> So a goblin I would have a goblin team I would have just knocked over less players. <laughs> oh man. Maybe I should have followed up that one dice push. No, I don't think so. That would have really been crazy, wouldn't it? At least I got forward that turn anyway. If I did a play like this Gavin guy, I'd get a push on the block on the corner beastman. And then I'd just be like, wow. <laughs> This fella, he's getting about what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Good old fash. <laughs> World Cup. World <laughs> Cup. Oh man. Have a top of the ladder beating guys like this, definitely deserve it. <laughs> what a testament to skill. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, dear. Fash being being tactful as ever. <laughs> It's pretty good because actually him taking him away there is let us reverse. Even even if he, even had he succeeded in the dodge, ah, he's removed another player. <laughs> so far, he's caused both armor breaks and both chaos. <laughs> Just quietly, um, that lets me reverse over here now, doesn't it? Um, even if he'd made that, I would have still gone for the reverse over here. Um, but obviously, him failing it makes things a lot better. Fucking Anarin pretending like he doesn't know what I sound like. 
<laughs> Shameful. <laughs> right. So it's actually pretty tough now because I can't make safe blocks, safe moves first. Literally can't. Um. So I've just got to do go for if he's on in eighty ones. I feel bad. Do not want an eighty one. Didn't want an eighty one that time. Good. Continue not. Got going. a KO. Unbelievable, yeah. Right. One, two, three, four, five. It, it's crap. I've got to make all these blocks before <laughs> before I do. <laughs> Oh, getting knockdowns now. Watch out. It's about your fifth one, isn't it? Armour breaks, yeah. This is looking good now, isn't it? No, it's fucking novels like, oh, I'm going to fuck you for the first five turns of the drive, make you real scared, and then we're going to balance things out so it looks good at the end. <laughs> yeah. Scumbag. Scumbag game. <laughs> I'm going to stay here, even though I'd like to follow, just to make this one a three dice. So. Of course, get the punch. Oh, boy. Classic. Classic a risky push. business, Jim. Punish for risk. <laughs> it wasn't. It wasn't that. It wasn't so risky. It wasn't. In, in fact, it made the block safer. Just the failure state worse, didn't it? Well, not failure. Pseudo failure. I can't get forward. <laughs> what if you pal the gutter runner? I haven't made a blitz, have I? Blitz him for pals. Classic gym. I should have pushed him to here, but I was thinking of going over this side, but then I can't go over that side. That was a horrible push square. <laughs> Alright, I've got to go in here. I can blitz the gutter. One, two, three, four, five, yeah. Oh, the AD English Invitational started. Glorious. Yeah, so, so much for the switch to the other side. It just went back a square, for fuck's sake. Great turn for removals, though. Should be able to. Yeah, they've got the space for this turn, for sure. Yeah, that three dice probably wasn't such a good idea. Oh, thanks, Sparky, good Sparky, luck today, Sparky. Jimmy. Thank you very much for the 200 bits. That's some luck now. The, the start was horrible, but now I've had some luck. Is but... it luck, though, or is it the probability bouncing itself out? Yeah, well, you know what I mean. <laughs> if things are happening as they should, do you define it as lucky or unlucky? I don't know. It's some luck, isn't it? It's better than getting one dice and stunned every time. <laughs> Put it that way. Yeah, yeah, so would you say that it's lucky if things happen as they should? To if, an extent, not, yeah. Like, to an extent. Yeah. Otherwise, you look like an ungrateful bastard, you know? <laughs> yeah, well, that's all I ever want in Blood Bowl. It's just for things to happen as they should. Yeah, me too. Really. Yeah. Really. He could surf this warrior, but it's a lot of resources, isn't it, to do it, so he probably shouldn't. No way, he should definitely commit all the men to surfing that warrior. <laughs> it would oh, be yeah. such a good idea. <laughs> I'm an idiot. Oh, no, oh, nah, let's boys, let's, let's boys. He's probably going to surf this warrior now, isn't he? <laughs> Can't do the accent. <laughs> <laughs> It just depends on your personal point of view, doesn't it, Mikkel Junker? That's the that's the thing, isn't it? Really, it, it it's up to it's up to each person to define what's lucky and what's unlucky, isn't it? Um, but I mean, I've definitely been lucky not to roll a one in nine blocks. I've definitely made over nine blocks. I mean, probably made about twenty blocks, and haven't rolled a one in nine. So I've been lucky in that regard for sure. Oh wow. It's a gift. 
unbelievable, Jeff. <laughs> yeah. What a good screen. You should leave it exactly like that. Oh, wow. <laughs> right. So, I have to make this book Are you ready for the 181? It's, it's coming. This is the only block that I have to make first. All right, good. I'm not going to follow because it doesn't block myself. So that I don't block myself. Staying fantastic. Right, get him out. Get your boy downfield. Oh, oh <laughs> God, safe play. Oh, yeah. <laughs> right. He's there. Um... One, two, three, four, five, six. This isn't so safe, actually. <laughs> Just because fucking if, Skaven. If the but, beastmen were closer to the uh, gutters, you could deny some of their squares. I don't know if that would matter or not. Uh, I mean, I'm just going to have to do this blitz before I move them now. And then I'm going to think about... Where... Oh, here's the one in nine. One in 81, yeah, classic. Boy. Classic. And it was, I had to just make classic. two blocks that turn. I only had to make two blocks. To get these guys out in front. Typical, isn't it? <laughs> so, <laughs> uh, so now I think I've definitely been unlucky because I haven't rolled 81 blocks, you know? That is outrageous. I, I just needed two pushes there, and then these, these could have come round, stopped everything. Maybe I didn't need to go so far. Maybe I didn't need to go so far forward, but I wanted to be able to have the leeway to go laterally one square next turn. I could have just gone here and, you know, been bracketed completely. But, um, wow. Wow. <laughs> you knew it was coming. Don't oh, yeah. called it nearly 1 in 81 first action. It was second. Don't tell us, why would you do that? Actually, the first action at least would have kept the ball safe. <laughs> doing it second, uh, <laughs> doing it on the second one, means that now uh, the ball's exposed. So I was actually unluckier than failing it first action. Of course, he gets the one dice pal. It's dirty mud. <laughs> dirty mud. He could have even made it two dice. Holy shit. <laughs> the fuck is wrong with him? <laughs> oh, man. He's even got time for the for a score. No, he doesn't have time for a score. He does, yeah. He's got a gutter here. So he's even got time for the score here. Four plus pickup isn't even hard. Wow. Dirtiest dinger. <laughs> this is a tough one to lose, isn't it? <laughs> I think if I draw, nice. I'll keep the team. Because Chaos are rough early. But I think it's going to be a loss. He can't throw it this long. Because it's uh, the weather, isn't it? So at least he can't throw it this turn. Never gonna give you up. One, two, Never gonna three. let you GFI, down. Two GFIs, one, two, three, four, five. One GFI. No GFIs in the snow. Three, four, five. Think one GFI. I have to. I have to hit him. I can't try and score myself. Um, it's just too difficult to score myself. I think. What would I have to do? Best possible scatter. After rolling a power five, on a two dice. That was pretty good. Oh, he, he's started with an apple. Oh man, he hasn't even taken a cast. Right, so one, two, three, four, five, six. Double GFI in the snow to two dice him. And then how do I even recover and score after that? I just don't. So I think the best place to try and blitz is scoring threat. Um, no, Jim, go for the win. You can just loot this team if you lose. No, I think that is going for the win by stopping his score. If I go for the hit on him, I fail, and he just scores. Yeah, so, and then I think, you just start again. I think go I for am the win, going for the win. It's a shame it's only two dice. Yeah, but then you still have to turn him over. So you'll just rely on turning him over next half? What if yeah. he just runs it down and scores early? Then I don't I'm think fucked. that's a reliable way. Then I'm fucked. Go for the win, Jim. I am Press one if you want Jim to go for the win. I am going for the Pressing win. Pressing one. Yeah, but going. go for the win and by scoring his drive. One if you want Jim to score his drive. <laughs> Jaken style. <laughs> bow, 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 bow. Jam toast, Colonel West. I don't tell us the traitor. Sparky Spark Spark and Mighty Rabbit knows what's up. You dirty mutt. Oh my god. Deserve to lose. Good. <laughs> That's what you get. <laughs> Nine anyway. <laughs> Wouldn't have mattered what I did. <sighs> no, that was me punishing you. I, I called up Nathias and said, change this next <laughs> dice to a pair of twos. Oh, 
<laughs> I don't think I've done anything wrong. I literally don't think I've done anything wrong. And I think he's done loads of things wrong. And yet he was closer to scoring than I was. Wow. That's Blood Bowl. Yeah, look, I, I think when you knew that there might have been a... Uh, like, he, he still could have got a gutter in for a 1-2. Uh, even if the block for a push happened and you got that man, all the extra beastmen up to make the three quarters of a cage. Yeah. I still think the gutters could have made it on some dice and got that 1-2. So the eye cage would have denied that, and there were no uh, strength three people that wouldn't have to make a dodge out that you couldn't have screened out. So I think instead of making the cage, making an eye cage, even though you could have been based in red dice, yeah. might have been you know, better in hindsight. Yeah, maybe it would have been an option, but I thought, it, you know, would he have seen how to get a one dice against that cage? I don't think so. True. Well, so... no, because he felt it on the last time on the other side. <laughs> <laughs> so I think I think it was. Yeah, I think it was kind of safer to, to, to go for what I went for, even though I did fail the one in 81. <laughs> Made it not safe. <laughs> you reckon them? Yeah, maybe. I don't know. More, more so than a red dice? Like, it's objectively better. Like, no one assumes that they're going to 181 a block. And so, yeah, for sure. But if we're talking, like, absolute risk mitigation, did you really need the proper cage? The R cage would have done, would have had three gutter runners in front. Yeah, maybe. And three gutter runners screening, you can blitz one uh, for a push and mm. just walk through. Yeah, maybe you're right. If when you lose this game, <laughs> <laughs> you cannot look at that town again and see who could have got there. No, I think, yeah, probably I cage would have been safer. Wouldn't have, I wouldn't have had to make another one in 81 roll. You're right. No, oh, it feels good to be right. Captain Hindsight. <laughs> Crucifix in his five and chair. all his chops already. <laughs> Fucking crucified. <laughs> oh, <dear. laughs> no, what would it surprise you? No, that's why I asked. Well, no, it really wouldn't surprise me. For sure. <laughs> yeah, no, yeah. There's a bunch of Russians that nobody cares about. It's probably just feeding him. Dirty mutt. Yeah. Captain Fashsight, yeah, that's true. I mean, it is obviously it's a real hindsight because all I had to do was not 1 in 81. To have a, but then it wasn't. It arguably wasn't a better cage. But then it's in the snow, and you would have had a GFI to get a one dice. It would have been really hard to get a one dice, actually. Yeah, yeah. for sure. But I mean, a newer coach doing you know a, a three plus for the one die, and he's shown he's willing to do the one dice. Why not throw in a three plus into the mix? But, Whereas when you just only give him a red, like new players seem to know that reds say, are bad. But you say only a red. Is. He would have gone for the red, wouldn't he? That's the thing. Giving him the red, he goes for the red. I reckon there's a huge mental difference for reds and 1Ds for new players. Do you reckon? I think he'd have gone for the red yeah. for sure. And if he'd gone for the red... Look, I would have, for sure. If I, if I was a Skaven and I was offered a red and that was all I had, I would do it, for sure. Yeah, so that's 43%. 44%. I don't want to just give him that. When 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 in a 1 in 81, any 80 times out of 81, I can make a much better cage and then maybe make GFIs to, to, fill, to fill the cage. Don't forget there was a chance of me making that block and then doing GFIs <laughs> and filling the cage. So, yeah, I think sure. the eye cage wasn't the right play. Oh, would you have done the GFIs? Oh, yeah, I was going to go for the GFIs. Final again, election? Yeah. Right. yeah, to close it off, yeah. Yeah, just because I thought you can't give him an uphill. I, I don't like giving bad players an uphill because, <laughs> no offence to this guy. Um, <laughs> they'll go for it. I mean, good players will go for it as well. But, you know, if the odds are in their favour. But it's an easy, you, you know... Yeah, so the, here's the thing, right? If it was Ducky, <laughs> yeah, and you've got the option of giving him an easy uphill or a hard one dice, then, um, you know, I think it's maybe a little bit different than against a bad player giving him an easy uphill because he will, he will always see the easy uphill and he will always go for the easy uphill. Whereas Ducky might think, oh, it's low odds, I might not go for it, or I might be able to find some engineer something better. You know, so, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Two pals in a removal. <laughs> Love Blood Bowl, me. <laughs> I don't. That's pretty lame, Jim. That was pretty lame. <laughs> Thanks for keeping me positive, Fash. <laughs> this is like the opposite of, opposite of an Andy Davo stream right now. <laughs> oh, makes me. Oh, look at this. Blitzen when he's got the free block. 
Yep, he could have just started a guy stood there, but didn't. But because he's scaven, he's going to have a cage in my half. <laughs> and it's, uh, yeah, the KO did come back. Yeah, I reckon that'd be him. insanity. As insanity as this guy marking. What the fuck's this guy doing? <laughs> oh, he's one of the runs everyone through. Yep. It's fair enough. In if he goes one another, I can't win. So it screws me if he scores. What a must. It kills the team if he scores here. <laughs> Basically. Well, maybe not. Maybe a draw isn't so bad for, for Chaos. Though, I think I'm looking at a loss rather than a draw anyway. <laughs> Yep, yep, Jay can say it happens though, doesn't it? It's a dice game, that's going to happen. You literally can't win every game with Blood Bowl. You just can't. You can't even win the games as you're supposed to. Um, you know, you just can't. You just literally can't. <laughs> yeah, it's true, fun folks. I do tend to mute and, uh, and turn off the camera when I eat. Very true. Okay. So I get to blitz one of these gutters and mark the other, put some pressure on the ball, base up all the all the shitters. Yeah, warriors are up there. They seem to struggle when you know in Ashley anyone does against the four strength team. Gives rubbish options. This won't fail. I am on the right. Burr, burr, burr. And then you final action on the gutter, so that you can both down it. Bracket. Bracket him. Looks like I'm not going to have much in the, way of ba uh, in the way of threatening the ball, unfortunately. Oops. Nearly, nearly made a horrific, uh, <laughs> horrific error there. I'd rather get someone in for sure and then make this block. And he's definitely, no, definitely standing him up is probably worth it. Though I'd rather have a warrior in there. Alright, so I've got nobody threatening the ball. Which is uh, less than ideal. Three dice, nothing. Classic. So that's good. So it's good that I wasn't greedy there because if I had been greedy, I'd have been left with an extra warrior down, wouldn't I? So the safe move did get me. Uh, did keep the warrior up there. Get the warrior up. <laughs> when we start the second team, yeah, maybe my hero. Yeah, the bad thing is this gives me two dice. Mm. Who knows? Who knows what was the right play? I mean, that's a bit more... See, that, 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 I would agree with you more, Fash, about the eye cage if I had no re-roll or if I wasn't going to re-roll. So it was a 1 in 9 because then it would have become a lot more risky. But the fact it was a 1 in 81 makes me think I'm right. <laughs> Or makes me like my decision a lot more. It's still hard to say if anything's definitively right, isn't it? No, that's a shame, random boy. Well, that, is that why you're random boy? Because you're a tiny, a tiny baby boy. <laughs> it's crazy that people born in '96 are grown ups now, isn't it? I just mate, born in 2000, 18 this year. Mind-boggling, isn't it? It's insane. <laughs> <laughs> and the, uh, only one more year until I can bang a girl who doesn't remember 9/11. So excited. <laughs> Crazy. And by doesn't remember, I mean wasn't alive when it happened. <laughs> <laughs> wasn't alive. When it... Where were you on 9/11? Ah, oh. <laughs> I was. <laughs> I was a spam. 
Yeah. It's crazy, isn't it? It's fucking mind boggling. I was at a Games Workshop when I found out about 9 11. Can you believe that? <laughs> fucking Games Workshop. Glorious. <laughs> Potential 12 hour stream. World Cup. If this doesn't deserve a resub, then nothing will. Stay fantastic. Glorious. Look at this dirty dingo. Thank you very much, Backyard Dodo. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Son of a bitch, yeah. <laughs> yeah, but I didn't put pressure on the ball, did I? really wanted a, a beastman in the backfield. Really sucked not having that. Thank you very, very much for the resub, Backyard Dodo. Thank you. Glorious. Glorious. Um... This not so glorious though, two scoring threats again. Can't base him up without blitzing the other one first. Can't really get a beast man through to pressure. I guess this is as much as I can. Let's do that first. Pretty fucked. Well, here you got a pal. Unbelievable, Jeff. Unbelievable. Do I make the GFI? Yeah, without a reroll. <laughs> Lucky boy. It's just, I just can't defend against him, though. That's the fucking problem, isn't it? He's uh, rotates. He can just do whatever he wants. I can't really stop him. Yeah. Ogres are dwarves. I could play dwarves. Yeah, maybe I should have gone wood elves like, like that other season when I went 18-1-1. <laughs> Hello, Tony. Yeah, I am still sick, but good enough to play at least. For fuck's sake, Tony! Stop being shit! Yeah, how many layers of fuck? Pretty fucked. About 81 layers of fuck. So is that like that? Nah, not even. This guy's doing dumb risky stuff every turn. Yeah. yeah, maybe he'll find a way to fuck it up. Like, right now, any action is critical value. Yeah, it's true. And it's happened for quite some time, and he's just been getting away with it. Yeah. Continues. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Why? <laughs> I'm never playing Bob Ball again. I'm out. <laughs> it is fast, yeah, Julio. Oh, dear. A bit of Bob, it's Julio. Mamma mia! <laughs> oh, excuse me! Oh, Madonna! I, I, when I played an Italian guy in a tabletop, in a, he just kept going, Oh, Madonna! Every, every roll, it was amazing. <laughs> Arriva <Everybody don't cheer. laughs> Oh, God. Look at this motherfucker! <laughs> hey, buddy, why don't you try failing something fucking ever? <laughs> um, I don't know who it was. I, I beat him, though. I, I did beat him, and he didn't like it. Any gutter 3 plus 2 plus, any 1D, any dodge, and Jim was through uh, yeah. for a 2D on the ball. Yeah. Uh, it's just willy nilly, like no trouble. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Maximum <laughs> risk, unpunched. Yeah, Disgusting. <laughs> Everything succeeded. Well, it was on my one turn, it was a 1 in 81. That, that was the critical failure and it came he's he's had multiple chances for critical failure and hasn't failed any on, and he was failing him on like one in three wasn't he well one in nine I guess you could have re-rolled them but still oh 
It's not like I'm giving up. It's just that uh, it's over. Unless I got lucky. Oh, <laughs> oh fuck. This is pretty rough. Pretty rough. Right. Oh, that's a dodge. I clicked too quick. Yikes. Of course my misclick leads to failure. I'm trying to do safe moves first. He, I mean, he wasn't trying to do them first. His weren't misclicks. His were actively trying to do them. I'm trying to make... I'm trying to not do what I've just done. It didn't matter. <laughs> it's what you think you saw. You did not see. Here's Jim. He's clicking too fast. Yeah. Black hoodie. Short hair. He's having a heart attack. <laughs> At least it wasn't a critical failure. But annoying to have used a reroll, isn't it? Very annoying. Can imagine I would have re rolled a double skull here and used my reroll then. <laughs> that makes sense. Yeah, all the beastmen are called hype for guy, yeah. <laughs> Right, that was a bit of a horrible turn, wasn't it? Making a dodge that shouldn't have been made, but never mind. <laughs> yeah, hopefully made pre-made enough teams or lenses. Hello in Arian, by the way. A salty veteran bidboard coach, he just hundred percent. Not me, Jelly, I'll not salty anymore. Not salty anymore. Never salty again. When the moon hits your eye, just like big pizza pie, that's Jelly L. <laughs> and after all that, he's just going to roll some threes and twos and I can't stop him. When the streamer starts to whine, because he's having a bad time, that's Jelly <laughs> <laughs> Well, that was an observation, wasn't it? I mean, that's scared, that literally. That ring thing, I'm it up. That is just literally scary, and they're going to roll some two plus, and you, you can't stop them. Yeah, but that was that's what normals you have now. You know, two pluses, and you can't stop them. This was this guy doing dumb shit. Yeah. And I just hate to see dumb shit get rewarded. Yeah. <laughs> Can even do a handoff pass now. Yeah. Handoff. Huh? Yeah. So three two pluses, fifty percent user oh, reroll. Boy. Some percent chance to fail. <laughs> Team dead. Yeah, I am. I'm is positivity. I am even in the positivity uh, thing on on uh, on fucking Twitch now. Yeah, look, I've got five backup teams. Well done. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, my asshole reamed this game, isn't it? Outbashed. <laughs> Outbashed, out, outplayed, lost. Could have played better, could I? Uh, I don't know. That's your job now to get a perm on a gutter. Go. Foul every time. Alright. If you want to be part of Team Positive, could I? I mean, I'm not even sure I could have played. I could have obviously not made that dodge. That's the only thing that I've done badly. Which wasn't a blood ball decision. It was a. It was a me being inept at <laughs> with motor skills decision. Yeah. Um, yeah. One objectively bad dodge, and then two subjectively you could debate for an hour and not really have a definitive answer on the cage placement and the three dice block. Yeah. Other than that, I think it's pretty bang on. Yeah. Oh yeah, that that, that push decision so that I had to cage up badly. Yeah, that that was a bad yeah. one. That was a bad one. That the direction of the push was, was bad. Yeah, but that was sort of like fourth level. You had to think, oh, what if this fails? And then what I'll do next is do this and then this. And that's two minutes of thinking for a single turn. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But still, like, I should have... You'd have to be like chess master ten moves ahead. Even though you should probably consider backup plan. So yeah, you could count that too. Yeah. But I wouldn't say that was comparable to a three plus or the one dies that he's done. Not true. Oh, good. So... <laughs> 
<laughs> uh, sums up the game so far, really, doesn't it? That really sums up the game so far. Uh, Do you know what? Punch, you gotta go. If you want to be part of Team Positive, then uh, you've got to fucking suck it up. Stop bitching like a little baby and try and fucking play better, eh? <laughs> That's just that's just done now. Nothing you can do about that, is there? Out bash by Skaven, and then everybody goes down on the uh, pitch invasion. Wow. <laughs> God. <laughs> It's pretty, it's pretty one-sided, isn't it? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five, six. I could have had two players back for the pickup to counter the pitch invasion a little bit, but obviously, being being down players already, I didn't really want to put two back. And same, it covers against rock as well, doesn't it? If you have two players back, so you know maybe I should have had two players back in case of a rock or pitch invasion. So. <laughs> yeah, hippie, the di hype dying a little bit, yeah. I mean, this is game has been... I think it's been pretty close to a dicing. And I think that was the nail in the coffin. There's <laughs> no Iceland again. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, this wasn't meant to be. It's fair enough, isn't it? You can't win them all. Or any. <laughs> yeah, maybe I should have made Wood Elves, but that's the thing. If you go Wood Elves, you've got to fight Inarian for a spot, which is it's not easy, is it? He's going to put the hours in to get the the Woody spot. Christopher's going to put the hours in to get the Chorf spot, so going Chorf isn't very smart. So I thought I could be the guy to put in the hours to get the Chaos spot. But yeah, it looks like he's not even going to be a draw now, does it? Hey, uh, which of the leagues did you join? Because some have more tickets than others. I joined, and some are definitely I, weaker competitions than others. I did. I joined three leagues. Um, Ooh. The Rebel, just because I'm in the Rebel League, and I thought that was a good idea, wasn't it? Um, yeah. AD English Invitational, because when I saw it, I pissed myself laughing and thought it was a tiny league. Actually, turns out there's 180 teams in it, so it's not a tiny league at all. Um, yeah, but it, it's, once again, it's all about quality. So who do you know that is in leagues is sort of a, probably the most deciding factor, I think. Oh, do you know what? I can't even do a pass, can I, because of the snow? <laughs> There's just no way out. <laughs> There's just no way out whatsoever. Oh, God. <laughs> um, and then German, because I'm German now, aren't I? So I entered the German. The German qualifier. Uh, so yeah, I thought I, you know, at first I entered like everything, uh, like a madman, and then I just thought this is this is fucking stupid. I can't do this. Christopher got a full time job, so we might want to qualify twice. <laughs> yeah, maybe. Powder gutter, pretty amazing. Fail the dodge. Fail my first intentional three plus of the match. Oh no, second because I did the GFI, didn't I? So I did I did the GFI to hit the ball and one in one in nine and then made a dodge here and one in nine. <laughs> so two 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 three pluses on purpose and failed them both. Oh no, pick, pick, I picked I pick up the ball. Okay. Complete lying there. Complete lying. I did I got lucky to pick up the ball twice. Uh, see, the extra arms bot isn't working, Ducky, because BZL is away from his computer. So, um, that's what it is. Yeah, I was going to call... I, I, do you know what? I realised I should have called my team Manshaft Fantastish. <laughs> is what I should have done, but I didn't. Um, but I'm not qualifying for World Cup like it is. Yeah, how dare he? How dare he be away from his PC? But yeah, 
that is entirely relying on his PC work. So there you go. So a loss, a loss that I could, that probably no player on earth could have won. I would, I would go so far as to say as. It's one of those games, wasn't it? Despite it being set up to have been a good one, <laughs> with his questionable play and uh, and you know armor seven targets for for star player points, it could have actually gone really well this game. I just need to uh, yeah, onto the onto the second onto the second chaos team. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> yes, Pedro, yeah. Reset at 12, didn't it? So, this is the first one. I guess I could have conceded earlier and then got more games in, but I'm not going to concede if I, if I go in. Oh. Yeah, Jelly Ollie, yeah, exactly. But he didn't score this turn, so there's still vaguely a chance, I guess. Double G, double G oh. What can I do? Just one dice power him. That seems like the best idea. Oh! <laughs> Worked! I think Fash has tilted off the face of the planet now. Feels bad, man. <laughs> So I, I was, my first instinct was to go there, but then obviously I need to put him here so that I can block him away from the receiver. And one in nine it. <laughs> okay. Right. So I've got the play now anyway. I've got the play. Which is... All of this passed to him, then he hands off to him. And I'm sure it's going to work. Could work. Like, less crazy things have happened than this. Oh, so close. <laughs> Gets injured instead. <sighs> <laughs> yeah, very German. Or I lose efficiently. Yeah, Juhani, and that, that's what the data says. The data doesn't lie. Dode is always right. <laughs> yeah. Maybe I should change from chaos, I don't know. That is simply now. not true. The meta does not support <laughs> your assertion. <laughs> oh dear. Yeah. Oh well. Yeah, my good friend Dodo agrees with me. He agrees with me sometime when, when the data backs me up. <laughs> when the data backs his opinion, then uh, then he agrees with me. So sometimes we agree. It is it is a green screen, yeah. Big red couch. Spend the turn, make it, make it any faster. Now. One, two, three, four, five, six. No, there's, there's technically a chance to, to, to score. Technically a chance to score. So I'll go for it. No reason not to. <laughs> mm. 
Next six chaos needs and change ways. Yeah. Chaos are a bit shit. Aren't they? They're all right though. They're all right once they get some skills. <laughs> Yes, Pedro. I could have done the first action canoring threat. I could have done, but then I wanted to hand him off to be able to score. So. Quit the car wrecking game. Yeah, maybe. Uh, they changed the... Well, first of all, I got nearly everything I wanted in it. Nearly everything. And the, th the only thing that I wanted was a bad investment of resources, so I wasn't going to get it, really. Realistically, I wasn't going to get the only thing that I wanted in the game. So basically I got everything I was ever going to get in the game. So I was, I basically I completed it. So there was, it didn't hold anything for me anymore. Then. That was the problem. What can you do, eh? I'm going to play some Diablo 3. Going to go around running with my guy. And my guy's got like a fast horse and a big mace and I hit people and they're all gonna explode. Wow, you've seen it then Fat. I've seen you run around on a fast horse with a big guy and then hitting people with a mace. Yeah. You see anything to press one or two buttons and everything just does, so uh it doesn't seem particularly skill based. Is it like a clicker game? <laughs> it depends. Some of them are more skill based. Um the uh the wizards are very skill based. To the point where some people take skill out of the equation by making macros to do the button presses for them. <laughs> nice. <laughs> uh, but yeah, obviously that particular one isn't very isn't very skill based. No, some of the, some of the builds are some of the builds are not very skill based though. Most of it isn't very skill. It's mostly gear based, Diablo, and then. There's, there's no the, the, the gameplay is the same. Often. They've got these greater rifts, right? Where, whereby, um, you know, like that's the end game content is is doing these, you know, PVE missions effectively. But the difference in difficulty, there's no AI difference. It's just you know health pool. So whether whether you're doing a certain level ninety one or a level hundred and ten one, the only difference is whether you've got the gear, whether your gear is good enough to do it. You know, your gameplay... Don't they get extra effects as well? Like, I mean, more shit? Or greater levels of immunity? No, no, no. Or they do, like, just, lightning and shit when they get just, hit? No, it's just literally damage and HP scales. Damn. So, while, you know, somebody with a, with the same gear as you might be able to go one, one higher, maybe, or maybe two higher, it's essentially limited by gear more than anything else. So, um, so yeah, it's a bit, bit of a weird game anyway. So, that, that's that team dead anyway. Um... <laughs> If you watch that on YouTube, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and stay fantastic. Mm.